something about Kogi State. A few months ago, we spoke about Kogi State. I don't know in this branch who heard about it. I spoke about it in this branch too, correct? Is that correct? The video has gone viral. I've received calls from everywhere. And some people called me and said, since you have given that prophecy, I was waiting for you to speak concerning my state. A lot of people that were calling me from Kogi, he said, because we know when God says it is like this through you, it's always come to pass. Now, the Lord showed me two people that will be the major contender in that election months ago. The video is there. It has gone viral already in Action God TV, our channel. Now, the first part of the candidate came to pass this week that just ended. Is that correct? Is that correct? I told you two people will be the flag what? One short man and one... You remember it? One short man and one... One short man and one tall man. And I said something. That I saw where there is wrestling... And I knew, and I saw between the short man and the tall man, who, who did what? Who won the election? Do you want to hear who won the election? It's too early. <laughs> when is that election coming? November. Now, the short man has a match. Now, we're expecting a tall man to emerge on Tuesday. To make the prophecy complete. Then I will now tell you the next governor of Kogi State. <laughs> Now, let me say something. I, I want to give a warning to a tall man I've seen that want to fly the flag of the other party. Let him pray hard because there is a strategy now to remove him and put another short man. I repeat, that's a strategy now to remove the tall man and put another so that it will be between two short. But let him pray as he overcomes. Then as he overcomes, that means, like, I released that prophecy, I think, in June. Yeah, in June. And it went viral already. But let me say something. So that at the end of the day, after what happens, I think I had the other party's primaries on Tuesday. After what happens on Tuesday, we come. Then I will tell them who the Lord showed me in a vision months ago. That will be the next governor of Kogi State. The Lord showed us about Atiku being a major contender. It came to pass. The Lord showed us return of Bugari. Return of Bugari it came to pass. The Lord showed us the emergence of Omar Gege as deputy senior president. The video went viral. I gave that prophecy first Sunday immediately after presidential election. And it came to pass. The Lord showed us about Malawi president, who the next president he came to pass. He showed us about Liberia City alone. He showed us about River State. He came to pass. All the prophecies the Lord has showed us always appear some months. In fact, Ghana president, Nana Kufado, we gave his prophecy two years before he became the president. So God has been so faithful in all. So what I'm saying about the Kogi, because I promise I will make a comment before the final of it. I was waiting for the first short man to emerge. You know, when I gave that prophecy, a lot of people called me and said that your prophecy doesn't fail, but this one might fail. Because if who we are such, uh, thinking is who you're talking about, that person will not get the ticket. Because in his party, he has been rejected. I said, but God showed me this. And God has never failed me, and he will not fail me now. So if finally on Tuesday we see what we saw before, I can now tell you who emerges as the next governor of Kogi State. But for now, I will still hold on to God till all which he, God, has spoken unto me shall come to pass to the glory of God. Let's celebrate the King of Kings here.